Howdy folks, Ryan here, and I am back from my uh, second dose of COVID-19 vaccine. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Freshly vaccinated to 100% or whatever it gets you to. I don't know. Um, I got both vaccines now, so hooray. And as a prize for myself for doing such a good job of going out and being a responsible human being, fighting the war against COVID-19, I bought myself a donut. And of course you know, based on the last two videos that I uploaded that were not about video games, there is another special dream donut out right now at Tim Hortons. So today I present to you the finale of the trilogy of Tim Hortons Summer Donuts, THE. This way. Hold on. Hold on. Come on. I think this is as good as we're getting today. Vanilla Cream Puff Dream Donut. Look at that, it's got this big dollop of whipped cream on top, a little bit. I didn't know there was chocolate drizzle, actually. That's news to me. Uh, that's fine. I like chocolate, sure. And powder. It looks like this one's a filled donut. Uh, or maybe, hold on. And creamy. Yeah, poked right through, so it is a regular donut. I wonder if there's gonna be surprise filling though. That I do not know. And uh, after the strawberry shortcake donut tripped me, I am a little bit wiser to these dream donuts secret filling. So, uh, donut, bottoms up, cheers, whatever, I don't know. What am I supposed to say? I'm gonna eat the donut. Oh god, it's filled. Yeah, it's filled all right. Hmm. I think it's actually the same stuff as the strawberry shortcake filling. It's like a kind of a regular custard. And as far as I can tell, I did a little bit more checking into the donut. And the filling, I think, was all just the same. Uh, somehow they got like layers of color in the shortcake one, but it, I, I think only the top layer of frosting was uh, actually strawberry flavored. This, you've got custard, you've got whipped cream on top, it's all very vanilla, as the name says. Oh, surprise, right? Um, I didn't taste any chocolate at all. It's pretty good. There's the chocolate. It was on my fingies. So, what do I think about this one? Well, it was good. Um, I'm not really into whipped cream. If I'm honest, I'm not really, really into cream puffs, if I'm honest. So, it's not for me. Uh, I didn't dislike the flavors, it's just they're not the ones I pick. I prefer something fruity, you know? Something fruitier or um, chocolatier would be my preference in donuts. Uh, this. Like I said, it's good. It just doesn't do it for me. Um, would I recommend trying it? Sure. Yeah. Um, it's a dream donut, so it's a little bit more expensive. So you kind of got to have a good feeling that you're going to like it, I think, before you go out and buy one. But it's, it's still, it's, you know, you're not going to break the bank on a donut, right? Well, I don't know if there's actually anything else for me to say about this. Uh, it is the third special donut that Tim Hortons has put out this year. And I said there's a trilogy at the beginning, so I'm really hoping that they don't put out a couple more later in the summer just to prove me wrong, but Tim Hortons has done that kind of thing before. So, anything could happen. Anything could happen. All right, well, I think that is about all I have to say for today. So, if you like this video, consider giving it a thumbs up. If you've tried this donut, if you have tried this donut, what I meant to say, it came out a little bit slurry there, uh, maybe leave a comment let me know if you liked it more than I did, or are you going to try it because you think you'll like it more than I did? I don't know. But most of all, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you on the next 
Well, it's gonna be something else Tim Hortons related. I'll give you that little tidbit to hang on to. So, bye-bye.